there, there's so many um there's so many tools you have at your disposal when you're setting OKRs in terms of things that we can measure. And, and you know, the way that OKRs kind of grew out of that lineage of KPIs and things, there's this whole history of, well, let's measure everything, which is good, but, you know, it's kind of like what you're saying. It's let's measure what matters, right? Let's, let's figure out those things that are really prescient and important for us and what success looks like for us. And, and I think sometimes, actually, you know, you can be very dogmatic and say, oh, your OKR should never contain any, anything that even smells like an initiative that should stay out. But for me, uh, one, of the, one of the things that took me a long time to realize is that, yes, there is a difference between your OKRs and your initiatives, but also you don't have to be so rigid and so dogmatic. I've worked with teams where they have some great OKRs and then said, oh, and also we need to do this. <laughs> you know, we need to get this thing. This thing needs to happen in order for everything else to, to come together and for us to be happy. And, you know, I used to really push back on that. And, and more recently, though, I've kind of realized, you know, if that helps you to complete the whole picture and to get where you need to go, great. Put that in there, in there as a key result. Uh, do, do what you need to do uh, so that your team is enthusiastic and excited and fired up about looking at these OKRs. Because that's the other thing is, is you want OKRs that you are excited to check in on every week or as often as, you, as you're doing this. Because the minute that your OKRs feel like a distraction or they feel like you know, the, the sideshow, then you, you've you got to change them, right? They're, they're not the right things to be looking at. Uh, and so sometimes, I guess, if, if a, a couple of initiatives creep in or, or some different kinds of leading and lagging indicators that maybe don't feel quite uh, like they fit the traditional OKR model, I'm, I'm much more, uh, I think it's interesting when that happens. And I, and I like to welcome that dialogue and say, well, maybe, maybe we should put that in there. If that, if that leads us to some OKRs that we're really excited about, then that's, that's probably a good thing. Mm-hmm.